so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great so in this video i'm going to show you how you can create this kind of leaf texture in the blender with the help of the shader so without any further delay now let's get started tutorial and before starting the tutorial guys i just want to tell you if you guys want to do practice on this project file so you can download this project file from the description that will be free for my all subscriber so now let's start the tutorial so first of all what i'm going to do exactly i'm just going to delete these texture because i'm i just want to show you how you can create these texture so i'm just going to my material section here i'm already here and then i'm just going to delete it and i'm just going to delete from this part as well this leaf as well yeah that's look great and then i'm just going to my shading panel from here and here i'm just going to add one new node from the uh, this new button so here we get the one principal bsdf node that's look great by the way okay so after that uh, i will add one more node it's called color ramp so i'm just going to add this color ramp node from here yeah this is the color ramp node and then i'm just going to plug this color to this base color okay so it will look like this basically and that's so great so from here we have to just uh, create some color variation for that i have already saved some color code so if you guys want to do uh, copy these codes so you can use it and you will also get this code with this uh, project file so you can use it so i'm just going to paste these code here yeah something like that okay and then i'm just going to add one more um, slider here and then i'm just going to add the one another color code from here yeah from the here that's something like that okay and i'm just going to add one more and keep it here and then i'm just going to paste this color code into this slider okay and then i'm just going to select this slider and going to copy this color and paste it into here something like that and i'm just going to keep it here by the way yeah that's look great we can keep it here this one should be here yeah so that's look fine to me right now but here you can see right now we can't see any kind of changes in our leaves here you can see we don't uh see exactly what we have created here okay and i think we have to add the same material on this part as well so first of all i'm just going to give the name of this material as a okay, plant 001 and we'll add this material on this part as well yeah that's look fine by the way now okay so what i'm going to do after that so right now we can't see exactly what we have uh, created here we can't see these variation on these uh, leaves so for that we have to add one um, node it's called wave node basically i'm just going to add the wave node wave texture node basically yeah this is the wave texture so i'm just going to plug this color to the uh, fac so here you can see we'll see something like that okay and that's very close what we are expecting basically so first of all what we have to do we have to just change the uh, some setting from here i will change this x location to the diagonal yeah it will look like this and that's look great by the way and uh, apart from that you don't need to change anything from here you have to just add one more node it's called texture coordinate so i'm just going to press the control t so it will automatically create uh, the mapping node with the uh, wave texture and that's look great and i'm just going to change this generate as a uv okay so here you can see we are very close what we are expecting exactly and why i did the uvs because i have already unwrapped this plane basically here you can see if i will go to my uv editing section so here you will see we have a, a unwrap already this plane something like that so this is very basic unwrap basically okay so that's why i have choose the uvs so it will give our uh, better result here you can see okay and after that what i'm going to do i'm just going to change uh, these uh, position basically according to our suitability we can just change it yeah i think that's look fine to me and here you can see we have a perfect uh, leaf texture here and that's look great okay and one more thing guys if you if you will change the uvs as a object it will not give the same result which is we are expecting so which is we want 
so make sure before uh, adding the wave texture you just unwrap your model okay so it will give you freedom to uh, place the texture accord according to your uvs and after that you can just plug this uv to the vector so you will get the better results something like that so when i'm just going to take the render so it will look like this and here you can see that look great to me so that's how you can create uh, this kind of leaf texture in the blender with the help of the uh, node editor okay so that is very easy and very cool tip basically so thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button hit the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries if you have any suggestion please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys